Hello everyone, I am Nihok Zanok, and this is my Let's Play of Shadowrun. So yeah, I just uploaded it, and then I got uh, jumped by these guys. So, fantastic, huh? But hey, I ain't co going to complain. Uh, yeah, I'll just give all these to... All right, we're golden. Let's go. Uh, what am I doing? Okay, so we have to uh, run in, grab a guy, and then go. Uh, just like uh, any number of other times we've done this. out of the way. Nope. Show me some ID, pal. <laughs> oh, well, you see, the thing is, uh, well, defensive position. Dang it. Darn it. Stop trying to kill me! Out of here before I get jumped again. We're bad at this. Guys, come on. Don't leave me alone up here. Where's Phantom? Where are you going, Phantom? Crying out loud. No! Get back here! You wanna shoot those guys? We can go in here like normal people. Where are you going? Okay. Just, ah! Just get up here! Just make me so angry! All right, Phantom, I'm glad you're here. Do your business. Fantastic. Where's Winston? I swore I heard something down here!
Yeah, definitely a lot of police officers down there. Come on. There we go. Finally get everyone in one spot. There we go. I guess that's the best I can do, at least for the moment. Come on, Winston. You can't shoot people if you're all the way, you know, somewhere else. Uh, I need to have him invest in the electronic skill. you man where are you phantom crying out loud come on What are you doing? Crying out loud. Mostly these predator heavy pistols. That's fine, I'll take it. Free up some inventory space. Alright, Phantom, let's see if we can shut this whole thing down. That's it, huh? down and notice you are about to step on a concealed security plate. You fail to react quick enough and step on the on it. The alert sounds. <sighs> okay. Alright, let's go to the second floor. Oh, we were spotted. Yeah, this one is definitely better. Need to upgrade that one as soon as possible. Fantastic. 
fantastic. Well, this has been great. We're definitely not pulling off a uh, Metal Gear Solid t uh, level of stealth here. <sighs> Maybe when we're higher level. Okay then, I guess I do have at least a bit of knowledge. Still though, I would trust Phantom any day of the week. Hey, trauma patches. Those are good. Alright, Phantom, do your- ooh, wait, there he is! That's him! Hey, there you are, let's go, my new employer is waiting. Indeed, let's get out of here. What a lucky break. Ah, uh, nope, 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 nope. Okay, so, yeah, I'm going to sell off as much of these as possible for monies. Uh, let's get out of here. Crap! Everyone, back to the corner. Make sure the noob doesn't get shot. Any day now. Any day now. Well, it must be gone. No one's been shot for for about a minute. Questions, huh? Huh. Nope, I ain't asking those heavily armed guys any questions. As you exit the building, a Northrop PRC-42 Wasp descends to land in front of you. The typically one-seated chopper has been modified to include a second. The rigger pilot straps in your man, gives you the thumbs up, and sleekly disappears into the sky. You calmly, as if not to attract attention, stroll off to collect your payment. Hey, Flick, I think this guy's packing. You got a permit for that illegal weapon? Talk to them? You're coming with us. You are escorted into the. Oh! Well, apparently these aren't illegal, even though it actually is super duper illegal. Well, I paid a heavy fine, alright. Apparently I'm broke now. Well, shoot. Well, sometimes it pays to be a magic wielder. Anyway, 
right, let's sell these things. I have all my clips right. Okay, well, it's a bit surprising. I honestly expected them to take my guns. Because it's not America! But seriously, it isn't. Quite a bit of karma. Uh, haggard man, typical doctor. Yeah, I will help you. That's not the building I wanted to enter. Just too bad I don't have more inventory space. I don't need physical health patches. I need the ones for uh, mental health. Well, that's something. Uh, let's go for a karma bath. means we need to go find a hotel or something. Which I believe is this one right here. Talk to them. Keeping your cool, you answer all their questions convincingly. Finally, Lone Star continues on its way. Okay, then. Wiley's Gala Inn is a rather stark hotel in the center of the Penumbra District. While quite safe to stay in, it is rumored that the inn is owned and operated by the Mafia. Hello, young fellow. Care to room for a night? Looking for a place to stay? Fifty million? Easy money. Steaming mud of soy calf would be just whiz about now. Alright. So. Magic. How does it even work? Okay. So, uh, increasing both of these seems just about perfect. Yes. And yes. I should have a bit of a better reputation by now. And as for you, 15. Melee damage and grenade accuracy. Cool. Combat and cyber combat success. I think he should increase his shotgun power. Now let's we'll see what I can increase with seven points. Well, definitely not his body attribute. He should increase his biotech.
Yes. Be a better healer. And three points. That means I can increase a zero to a one. Or I can boost his intelligence. Quickness. I'll do quickness. All right. Ten. Peter increases success in cyber combat and the operation of nodes. Oh, if only I had more points for that one. I'm at the maximum level for intelligence. Pistols. Isn't he using SMG? Reputation of one. That's wasted points. Well, it'll increase your electronics. And that'll be it. Alright, we're all better now. I don't know where I'm going. Alright, where is my money? So go you some crids. Alright, show me some work. Step right up and I'll brief you on a job I'm positive you'll excel at. Go to the Underground 93 in the Poly Up Barrens. There you'll meet a client, Alan Turin. Escort him to the Mitsuhama's local office in the Penumbra District and you'll be paid by the client upon safe arrival at his specified destination. Just 220 million. What do you say, friend? No. Whatever you say, my friend. Need some creds? You can always work for me. I do need to go to the Penumbra District for uh, the Tassilar City Inn. I believe my reputation will allow me to talk to Tabitha Shale now. There's a community of ghouls somewhere in the Redmond Barrens. They have been preying upon the citizens there. Kill as many as possible and return here for payment. Forty, not for forty each. That's just set. That's just pathetic. No. Play a Fuchi's local office in downtown Seattle, Alan Turing. For a change in his career. Fortunately, his current employer. Alright, so we're working for someone else this time. Gucci. Alright. At least we're doing a run for someone other than Mitsuhama this time. Look for a good runner. Do we get to shoot people? Charge 170. All right. Let's go pick up Phantom. It's a surprising lack of blood for somebody who appears to be in as much pain as this man. Oh. Attack him. Pale figure reacts with amazing speed, leaping up to a second story window and into a building. thing I'll do is I'll go and deal with Tabitha before dealing with the uh, Fuchi. Runner. 
into Matrix when we're discussing. 390! Ah, uh, short term, yeah. You're expensive, but worth every dollar. Enter the Taurus Lars Garden Apartments. You are greeted by elves carrying submachine guns. One of the elves points the weapon at your face. I don't think you have any business here, do you, Chummer? Thinking over how quickly they could cut you to ribbons, they agree to you don't have any reason to be here and quickly leave. Okay, apparently I need to increase my reputation further still. Fine, let's just uh, go to down... Seattle. Oh, there's a guy in here I want to talk to. He's a magician, just like uh, just like Joshua is, but uh, bright-eyed young man is creating magical fire when you enter. Hello, please join me Look for some information. Might know something of use. What's your story, Chummer? My name is Trent. I'm studying the mystical arts, the powers of magic. I was studying at the university, but I quickly tired of the parlor tricks they taught there. I aspire, I aspire to learn so much more. I've decided to add to my experiences by working for those who will pay me to have them. Hmm. Uh, let's have some questions answered. Such as, I'm looking for some contacts. A number of an old professor of mine, Jefferson's his name, most folk only sell names to you, but the professor's always willing to talk with new people without the influence of money. He places his name in your pocket secretary. Cool. Oh, take care of there. That is my only contact so far. Rhiannon's 1500. Wouldn't mind a discount at Rhiannon's. I'll have to work for that. Anyway, where's that go? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuchi. <clears throat> Excuse me. Fuchi, Fuchi, Fuchi. See, that's the Space Needle. Where is Fuchi? You could say Fuchi, not Penumbra or something, right? There we go. All right, we'll save. And enter. You create a diversion and slip into the, into the office building. Now comes the hard part. Finding your quarry and escaping with everyone intact. Yeah, let's walk away from that. Fuchi's a little bit more brutal, I guess, than uh, Mitsuhama is. If I had a terminal logged into management database, perhaps searching the computer will provide you information. Uh, let's walk away from that. I am currently not the good, uh, right character for that. Well, no wonder... Uh, they're paying a little bit better for this one. They're a little bit more well protected. Well, that was easy. That's
That's fine. That's fine, though. I'm perfectly okay with this. Let's get out of here. Get out of here. As he exits the building in Northrop, yeah, yeah, yeah. He gets helicoptered away. Hey, buddy. Flustered woman passes by you. A moment later, a grungy man passes in pursuit of the woman. It seems to you that he's planning to harm her. Hey, what's going on here? The woman calls to you for help. The thug that was falling uh, calls to some friends as he pulls his weapon. I think I just killed an innocent person. But hey, some a model 101 tease. Let's go sell these off. Here at that point I can call Professor what's his name and get those uh, discounts at Rhiannon's. future I need to do another matrix run so I can start getting some more money it's gonna be the best area to start really seriously upgrading after that would be magic some crits. Alright. Put me on some more work. Go to Dr. Bob's Quick Stitch in the poly... That's what I was looking for! Contact there will give you a package. Yeah, I'm not doing that. Simple Matrix run. Alright! My client wants his management records updated. Upload this file to to record a substantial raise and log extra vacation time for him. Return here to collect payment when this has been accomplished. Let's hire Winston. All right, Winston. Yeah, the last one was fun. Charge 165. Yeah, let's just do short term. Glad you're enjoying yourself. I can get into this exclusive club now. Club Penumbra is the most decadent in all of the nightclubs in Seattle. Some people claim they have been in the waiting list for more than a year. The doorman smiles as you ask as he asks your business. I'd like to go in. The doorman's smile fades when you ask ask to enter. We serve an exclusive clientele here at Club Penumbra. 
Please come back when you are more well known to our patrons. A well mounted auto gun. A, well, uh, a wall mounted auto gun swivels toward you. It seems like a good idea to leave. Nope. Apparently, I'm not internet famous yet. to go in here. This is the Magic, a high-class nightclub that caters to the corporate clientele of downtown Seattle. A well-built and well-dressed human guard stands at the door checking IDs and credit sticks. I'd like to go in. Sure thing, chummer. Just fork over 150 large and I'll get you in. Fair deal, no. I'll, uh, talk to you later. Actually, I'll, I'll come back. The guard watches you leave. I just have darn it. Hmm. You know what? I'll just stop by the uh, Seattle General on my way out. Why do you hang out in here? Uh, 255. All right. Or looks you over with an obvious content and gazes at your elf companion. Normally we frown on breeders here, but since you're with the family, I guess we can seat you. Two elven bodyguards, so cybered and wired they hum, block your passage to the darkened booth. You decide that this is not the appropriate time to make friends or enemies and move on. working on a cyber deck here. It turns as you get closer. What? Hello. Looking for some information. I may have something you covet. What's your story, Chummer? Heartbane was an ancient elven leader. She prophesied the Matrix, a place where everything and nothing exists. A place where wars are fought and blood is shed without weapons. She knew it was going to be big. So I use Heartbane as my street name, uh, coupled with my true name, Rihanna. I've been running the corpse since the inception of the Matrix. I've been just as... I've been just about every type of IC and flatlined my share of Decker cowboys. Without Deckers like myself, the corpse would grow unchecked. Be even more power than they do now, which is saying a lot. Need some questions answered. Like... Uh, tell me about corporate security. Tell me about the Matrix. The Matrix holds some keen realities. I've heard stories uh, some corps are actually creating life in the Matrix. Artificial intelligences. 
it's all possible in the Matrix. Even, even so, my talents and skills are never to be duplicated by some program. If you want to crack a system, nothing can compare to raw elven talent. If you want to run a corp, I'm a woman. Interesting. I... I guess I'm done with Phantom now. Uh, tell me about security procedures. Simple, they are deadly. If you don't have top-level software and an awesome deck, not even my skills can get you in. If you got the wares, the best way to run a corp system is by jacking in from inside the corp. From there, you can enter the system via I.O. ports, which are usually less protected than the sands. Much easier to get what you're after. Interesting. Alright. Uh, I'll check you out later. This I believe. You enter the booth. It is extremely dark. The diminutive figure, figure seated there exudes confidence and charisma. His voice is a rich baritone. Let's get one thing straight. Business is business. The name's Julius Strother, and I like to keep things on the up and up. So tell me, how can we help each other today? I'm looking for some information. I'd be happy to tell you what I know for a modest price. A thousand grants you a contact. The questions are free for the moment. I need some questions. May I illuminate you? you heard of a Johnson named Mortimer Reed? <laughs> the guy's a major thorn on my side. He's the competition and he doesn't play very fair if you catch my drift. I'd watch myself if I were you. There was a contract. Uh, there was a contract out for that guy. You can't trust him. Right. Okay, looking for some information. Some contacts. I can connect you to an ex-merc who knows a lot about breaking into the Hollywood Correctional Facility. The guy's a real pro, so I wouldn't be upset uh, if I were you. I wouldn't upset him if I were you. Treat him right, you might be able to supply you with some useful equipment if you catch my drift. You want his name? Pay it. Drew Strunther uh, transfers you name into his account, and then puts the contact's name and number into your pocket secretary. His name is Captain Quentin James. He spells it with a Y. Seen a little too much action he has, but it's worth the price. Alright, I'll talk to you later. Bye. Well, let's see what we got. Captain Quentin James sells frag grenades, sells a stripped HK227S, offers a rigor contact. Alright, now I'm officially broke. Alright, Phantom, I'm broke. Fix it. Okay. All right, save and run. successful with it for once. Dated files. Well, at least I'm in a place where I can get easy money. Let's see how much data I have left. 
14. Yeah, I think it's time to go. Backup files is useless. Ye useless. Fantastic. Fantastic. At least if I know if I raid their outdated file system, I can, uh... Yeah, no wonder it was so easy. If I go to the wrong node, it might end the uh, mission prematurely. But if I lean on this one... They, they really skimped on the security here. You upload the file to the data store, run a comp, look great. Alright, that's fine. What are you scheduling? Surprisingly well protected. Not well enough, apparently. Ah, that's why. Financial data. MP worth. Yes! Let's get out of here. Hopefully this will be worth something. Useless. 600, 1600, 600. Well, it wasn't nothing. I at least made all my money back. Maybe I'll get that discount at Rhiannon's. Grenade, 
Yeah, no, we're not doing that. Uh, no. Winston would love that kind of mission, but, uh... office. A package is taken from a courier. We'll do that. All right, Phantom, you are officially retired. Probably do me good just to get him on a long ter term term uh, situation. Oh well. Let's go pick up Rhiannon. trying to sell any stuff. Alright, elf lady. Looking for a good runner. Are we, talk, are we talking something I can sink my, sink my teeth into? Charge 190 for a single run. 1190 for a single run. Yeah, sure. See what you got. Unlock 22 SMG. Pathetic number of clips. Yeah, we're gonna have to buy everyone just like a bunch of clips. Let's look at your skills. Okay, so yeah. She is quite good. I'll keep her. Let's go get you an electronics kit. Let's see kind of... You have a line duster, I think we all do. No, no, no. Yeah, we need to sell that and get use an armor jacket. To the crime mall! Uh, what kind of cyberware do you have? Smart link and two wired reflexes. But, uh, all right, so weapons and equipment. Sound suppressor is her side, I guess. She has a guessment too for SMGs. Yeah, it's fine. Let's uh sell your armor. Yeah, nowhere near able to 
to get that yet. Hmm. Oh, he gets it for nearly a hundred off now. Cool. I think I should just go to the Redmond Barons to get my ammo. is what I'll do. Alright everyone, we're going to the Redmonds. That's it. I'm gonna have to get a free ride to uh, to the downtown Seattle. Let's see, he has 20 and she has 12. them both out to 26. Yeah. Alright, I'm broke. I have that guy's money now. Should be enough money for cab fare. So we don't have to be filthy liberal freeloaders. Hey, flick, I think this guy's packing. Run away! Got a permit for that illegal weapon? You outrun some of them, but the others appear to be in better shape. You overtake they overtake you and open fire. I thought you were good at this. Yeesh. have quite a bit better aim than uh, I gave him credit for. Oops. Uh, yeah, let's walk away from that. Heal. I give you the power to heal. Hey, what's going on here? The woman calls for help. The thug uh, opens up for the weapon. 
Oh, I know why, because I didn't equip the armor. What a doof. Gun. AK-97. Alright, here we are, and we can continue this next time. Thanks, take care everyone, and see you later.